All right, let's have a hangout session. All right, guys, welcome everybody jumping in. So cool. All right, guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. We've got who have we got in the room so far? David Black, the man himself. Peter's here. Nick's in the house. Kate's here. Shay's here. All oh. right, guys. <laughs> fantastic to see you guys thank you so much for jumping in today is a very informal session my brother johan how you doing man i'm fantastic i'm so excited man in 48 hours it's 24 48 hours in 48 hours we are going to be Not in many <laughs> in in very short amount of time we are going to be in dallas i'm so excited dude nick you look like maverick bro that looks amazing that's like that is a background and a half man that is amazing that's that's my uh that's my uh profile according to all those wheels and stuff you know i'm a maverick nice so trusted maverick business consultant good day guys how are you Fantastic, mate. Great to see you. Thanks so much. That's actually wicked. I love the I love the like view in the coffee. Oh, sorry, Kate. We just have to mute you there. But you're more than welcome to come on and say hello, Kate, by the way, and uh unmute and join us. All right, guys. So uh um little small crew. I think uh we just wanted to hang out and say hello. Yeah, we're in Dallas in 48 hours. It's gonna be insane. Guys, is anybody else coming to Dallas? Who's coming along to the to the uh, level up? Let us know. Is bot one going to be ready for the summit? Hell, uh, oh well. Is is uh, is autopilot going to be ready for the summit? Uh yeah. It's uh, I tested it last night. So yes, yes, it's been released into uh, public today uh, in its first version. So um, first version is data being pushed. So in other words, um, we do something like uh, somebody opts in on your website and puts their website in on a form. And um, then the system can run all your AI queries. It can run all the enrichment and then it can send it straight back to your GHL with zero human interaction. So that's autopilot version one um, and version two, where it's gonna be actually doing the searching on autopilot with zero human interactions, probably another week away, I would say something like that. But yeah, version one of autopilot is live now as of this morning. Now I haven't tested it in live. I tested the heck out of it last night in staging, but I haven't actually even uh, logged on to test it live this morning, but my team have been on it. So um yes is the short answer i should learn to sh i should answer questions in shorter ways shouldn't i mate <laughs> no no it's all just good. say yes and walk out that's it done no 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 no. it's all good so guys today is a very informal quick easy we've got 57 minutes of just it's a hot seat it's a ask us any questions do you need any help with anything we're here to just have a quick chat and hmm. see how we can help you move move the needle and move. we love we love strategy. We love we love talking marketing stuff. And um, so what I want you guys to do is just down the bottom of the Zoom room, there's a little button that says raise hand. If you've got a question or you want to jump on, hit that raise hand button because we'd love to, like we said, there's there's no PowerPoints today. There's no releases. Tomorrow we're doing a big uh, thing about Dallas. So we're going to be walking through exactly what we're presenting in Dallas. Um, and and we, we're going to Dallas with the banners, the collateral, the everything that says sell more GHL. So tomorrow we're going to be going through exactly what we'll be talking about in Dallas, how you can use this system and the, the four bot system that we've been talking about for the last six weeks to sell more GHL, to build your SaaS business. So that's what we're going to be talking about tomorrow. But today is just hanging out. So yeah, guys, raise your hand and say hi. And and if you don't, Johan and I are just going to ramble. So um, <laughs> jump in. Um, tomorrow's meeting, Dave, You, I mean, you know about it, Dave, but uh, tomorrow's meeting is uh, 3 p.m. Eastern, which Johan is 6 a.m. for you and 5 a.m. for me. And then I'm going straight in the Uber. Uh, off straight to, to the hotel. Air. Yeah, right. Exactly. So we'll be we'll be straight into it. Kate's got a question. Hey, Kate, jump in and say hi. Let's see if we can ask Kate to unmute. Let's get Kate on the call. Yeah. Hi, Kate. Unmuting. Hiya. Sorry, I don't know what's happening with my video. Um, That's okay. Right. I've got, got a couple of questions about enterprise, actually. Yeah. Sure. Um, so, yeah, I was so really seriously considering enterprise. And nice. um, so I went on to Prospect Falcon earlier mm -hmm. and was, was sort of asking the chat bot some questions. Mm -hmm. And it says, it says there that you can... You can have, um, if you pay monthly, it's 500 credits, but if you pay per, per month, and if you pay annually, it's, no, sorry, it's 50 credits per month if you pay monthly, but if no. you pay annually, it's 100 credits per month. No. Is that what the chatbot said to you? 
Well, that's what the pricing page says. Hmm. But then when I asked, I, I said to the chatbot, <clears throat> what if I want 200 credits? And the chatbot came back and said, yeah, yeah. Um, Is this yes? Hey, credits. did you have this conversation yesterday? This morning, my this time. Morning. So Damn, my I updated time the here. knowledge base. I updated the knowledge base last night. So, no, 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 that, that, uh, so, that so is, what, that is what, it, what it came back to say was was that that yeah, sure, you can do two hundred credits um, mm -hmm. in our standards plan. And I went back and said, but your website says fifty for monthly and a hundred per uh, for you, annual. So which is it? Where, so okay. yeah, can you tell me where you're seeing that? Um, okay, because I'm I'm on the site right now, and I'm. Uh, okay, so, let me so just our, go our, prospect falcon. Yeah, our prospect falcon plan. Just so that um, we can get some clarity there, our prospect falcon plan is uh, 500 credits per month. So if we've missed a zero, I apologize for that. Um, but yeah, 500 credits per month, and then it's six thousand per year. So if we go to the pricing page, which is uh, here, maybe that's uh, pricing. So pricing, six thousand credits that? per year on the annual plan or 500 credits per month. Okay, yeah, so, so you're at 6,000 credits per year, and if we go to monthly, yeah, 500 credits per month. Okay, yeah. so that's right. Okay. I think that was different this morning, but maybe it was me. <laughs> <laughs> might have been, that, you might have just yeah, read that... it. You might have, you might have been reading zeros. I do that when I look at my bank yeah. account. It always has less zeros than I want it to. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, so that, that makes a lot more sense. So mm -hmm. that's that's fine. So if you go enterprise, that's what you get for ninety seven dollars a month. It's five hundred credits per month. No, um, no, 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 no. There might be like a little. Let's let's clarify something there. When you go enterprise, you get your own branded setup version of Prospect Falcon. So you'll get uh, your own your own website. You'll get your own um, system. You can set your own package. So when when we set when we set oh, it up great. for you. So, so let me just like see if I can grab a couple of examples. Um, so we've got uh, this is Jen. So Jen's got her own version of uh, of Prospect Falcon, and so she's got it set up. So this is this is OptiLead. This is Jen's program. Um, so we've set this up for her. So the the um, the system is completely how you want it to be. Dave, have we got um, Phase One set up for you, Dave Black? And if so, can I show off your site and? Uh Yes, I believe that it is set up. So I saw What's... it's uh, under uh, it... Lead Panthers. Lead Panther. Oh, Lead Panther. And then you've got leadpanther.com. And I think we've got, um, so this is Dave's enterprise version. Um, leadpanther.com. Okay. So that's, we might have the leads on a different site there for you, Dave. But um, we had uh, fresh sales leads from one of our team as well. So there we go. So that's uh, for sales leads. So you, so let me just clarify, Kate, when you, when you buy the enterprise version, we set up your system for you. So you tell us what packages you want. Like we, we have a standard cookie cutter set up that is um, 97 bucks a month is the 500 credit package. 997 is the um, 6,000 credit package. We just set that up as cookie cutter because one of the questions that we've been constantly asked is what should I price it at? How much? Should I? And we just said, like, let's just set it so that we can give you a, the delivery quickly. But if you come come in, it's your business. If you come in and go, you know what? I want to sell a thousand leads for $5,000 or I want to sell a hundred leads for 297 a month. Whatever you want to set it for is up to you. We're, we deliver it. Cool. We deliver you back your own branded version. The other thing with the enterprise plan is, so we set it up. We give you your onboarding system. We give all of the automations in the background. We give the AI systems to answer all the inquiries. So, but you get your own version of the program completely set up and done for you. Okay, that's brilliant. Thank you. Uh, the other question I had on that on enterprise was to do with. Um, taking payments because previously I had been thinking oh, I'll go white label until until I heard about enterprise mm -hmm. um, so with I, you know I've got a white label version of GHL um, mm -hmm. which is SAS mode mm -hmm. uh, and so people pay me I mm -hmm. couldn't I couldn't quite work out what the difference is with enterprise do people pay me or do they pay no, you. they pay you. They pay you. They, when we deliver it, okay. it's every single dollar that rings through that system goes into your account. 
So um, the when you when you own the white label version of um, our system, you own every single transaction that comes through. Um, with enterprise, literally, again, we just we set it up for you. So we take away the the learning curve. We make sure that it's just delivered and done. Um, but every dollar is yours. So do I need white label and enterprise? No, no, no. Uh, enterprise replaces. Just enterprise. Enterprise. Yep. Okay, cool. Thank you. Yeah, um, nice. And Kate, just that, just one, cool. I, I'd like I'd like to give you one more clarification on that too. So the system is built so that you don't have to do any of the tech work, so that you can go out and sell all day long. And then the system at the after they've sold a package of whether it's ninety seven, one ninety seven, whatever it is. The fourth bot, so the first bot finds the leads, second bot talks to them, third bot calls them, fourth bot delivers, supports, onboards, and then it upsells them. That upsell is to whatever your normal product and services are. So we have clients using it to set and forget while it then upsells their stuff. So for example, if someone says, hey, you're in car sales, I saw Mr. Dooley here, car salespeople, you know, you're generating leads, et cetera. You can target all the CEOs who love BMWs and Maseratis. And then, hey, if you move jobs, we can hook you up with your own, not if you move jobs, we'll hook you up with your own CRM, which you can take to any job in the future. This becomes your little thing. Would you like your own CRM, right? And that's how you upsell them, JHL. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. That's that's as an, as an example. Or if you're targeting business coaches, you say, hey, we've got all these leads coming through. You've got the tool, fantastic. How would you like us to now upgrade your website? Do your videos, do your brochures, run your Facebook. Yeah, ads. so whatever whatever other business services you have, yeah. Does that make okay. sense? Okay, so yeah, it does. Um, so when I sell to um, you know X Y Z company um, through what my my enterprise version, um, so I've got I'll have an, an a, a GHL account through you, and so you set them up with their own GHL account. No, 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 no. So, okay. Again, what, what we deliver back to you, Kate, is your own standalone lead generation software business. So you've got, so when somebody buys that from you, they will receive their own login and password to your lead generation software business. So you make a sale, they've now got a, a license they can log in. So let's say that you call your your business ABC leads, whatever it might be. So they are now logging into ABC leads. They're logging into their own system, your customer. But in terms of what else they get, GHL, um, whatever else other products that you want to sell them, that's completely up to you. So like you can, you can upsell them GHL, you can upsell them SEO or whatever else you want to do. But when they buy from you, they get their own lead generation software program. That's that's the package that we deliver back. So we, the enterprise program and the, the white label suite program, the same, you just have to build it yourself. Um, the enterprise program will give you your own operational lead generation software business with all the automations and AI systems in the set up and ready to go. Jonas, okay, the uh, so enterprise is nine ninety seven a month. Yeah. Yeah. So when they buy, mm -hmm. um, so that, yeah, so they generate leads and then they can put mm -hmm. that into any CRM. They so if they've got HubSpot or or anything else, they can yeah. put it into there. Mm -hmm. But if they don't have a CRM, I can I can upsell them um, my SaaS. One hundred percent. Okay, cool. That's really yep. clarified it. Thank you very very much. Appreciate it. No, that. you're welcome. No troubles at all. And um, we had some great success. You mentioned HubSpot, which is an, a, a, an awesome trigger for me because HubSpot, typically a HubSpot business, will never change their CRM. They've invested $50,000. There's no way I'm changing. You know, that that's HubSpot. People are very bedded in. Um, when I first said this to Sean Clark, he just got so excited. He brought all his team over. We, we love when we sell this system, the lead generation system, we love selling the GHL component as a pre-CRM to HubSpot. So somebody with HubSpot, if you're trying to sell them GHL, for example, they're going to go, no, don't need it. Got HubSpot already invested. I know it's cheaper, but I don't need it. No, thanks. I'm good. And we couldn't get past it. Like we were, we were struggling to make inroads to somebody that's already invested so heavily in their CRM until we said, do you know what? HubSpot is amazing. Keep it over there. 
and let us run this other CRM as what we call a pre-CRM. So we can run your leads, we can do the outreach, we can nurture and qualify in a pre-CRM so that you're not paying a contact cost in HubSpot. And then when that lead is qualified, we're just going to zap them straight over for you. So keep your HubSpot system, nothing, nothing changes, but you pick up this program to run all your leads and marketing before they become a customer. And like our HubSpot people were going, <gasps> and Sean Clark was like, <gasps> that's the best way to sell it ever. It's like so good. So like that, I, just as a pure um, sales tip for you, if you come up against HubSpot or SAP or Salesforce or any of those ones, run your GHL system, sell your GHL system as a pre-CRM, marketing CRM, so that you can then push the qualified leads over. Hopefully that help, that's helpful anyway, Kate. Sure. Hey, Michael. Yeah, do perfect. Thank you very much. I'm signing up tomorrow. <laughs> oh, cool. Awesome. Let's go. Hey, Michael, you, you, got, a, you got a way to frame it? Go for it. Lo would love for you to share. Yeah, so we just we don't call it a CRM at all. We call it a, an LMS, a lead management system. Nice. Um, and yeah, That's same cool. sort of thing. Yeah, so LMS, lead management system, and it's only because like obviously our ideal clientele who we deal with, they've got you know very industry specific CRMs already pre built out. You know, for the auto industry and for auto finance. So. Um, yeah, we, we bring it in as an LMS, same sort of thing. Okay, this here is where you, all your client communication and this is where all your lead handling and everything is going to be. And then we just set up triggers to go back over, you know, webhook or um, if you're going to get really fancy ADF XML straight out and into that other CRM as well. So Nice, fancy um, indeed. Yeah, and, and even... My language, sorry, I'm just like, ooh. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, and, and even like... Um, <laughs> You know, medical as well. Like we signed, we did a custom build out the other day, which I think I mentioned to you guys for a mm. medical center. And just even as simple as like the sales pipeline, having it set up where having a sales pipeline stage of send to CRM or send yep. to whatever. So then that way, when the pipeline stage has changed, the back end workflows all kick in and then obviously send off the webhooks to, to drive that traffic across to wherever it might be. So yeah. Perfect. That's, That's really, really mate. So an LMS, that's really awesome. It just, uh, it takes away from your need to compete with yeah. other businesses. Like that's, um, that's very, very cool. Um, by the way, triggers in GHL are not working this morning. There's a, there's a storm going on everywhere. Um, triggers and automations and stuff like that are not firing in GHL anymore. So, uh, not anymore. They're just, they're in they're I think they're in, um, what do you call it? Sp sprint and break it mode. Like, Nick Constantino with your with your flight in, but they've just hit go and they're off the thing, ready for Dallas. Um, they broke something this morning. That's uh, so their their workflows and automations are not working. So I'm pretty sure that their staff members are all on red flashing amber alert this morning, trying to deal with all that stuff. But I'm sure it'll be back online pretty soon. Um, yeah. So I love that lead management system. Very cool, Mike. That's awesome. Thanks, Michael. Hey, I've got a question from Mr. Robert, and he said it. So guys, Robert, hey, Robert. Robert's done all of our. Um, all of our collateral for the event. Printing, and so, brochures. Printing, brochures, all of that. And Robert just said, may I make copies of the bespoke booklet for our brand in his brand? And I said, hell yes. Guys, nice. all yeah. the collateral that we're building, we're going to give to you. That's the reason why we're telling you tomorrow we're doing our reveal of what we're going to be presenting at uh, the conference. You can have access to all of that collateral. So it saves you all the time. Our team is building stuff. As we build stuff, we're going to give it to you so that you can just rebrand mm -hmm. it. Use it for your, use it for whatever you need to. So just thought I'd to make that public. So you have that there. Um, the next question I have from Milos. Can we sell enterprise without buying it first? 100% you can sell enterprise without buying it first because we have people all day, every day going over to Prospect Falcon and demoing it. We're seeing all the, we're getting so much data from you guys. It's hilarious. It's awesome. Like people are now using it to demo and they're like, hey, go, go talk to, go talk to Falco, go have a chat. And they're showing it off. And then people are going, I want that. And yeah, so 100%, you can sell it without buying it first. No problem. If you want to, there, there are people who say, no, I want it in my brand. Well, it, it, the only way you can get it in your brand is to sign up to Enterprise and have it all branded there. Another thing with Enterprise is a week from, so we've systemized everything. Thank you for everybody who's jumped in early. Everything's getting, getting systemized. In a week now, we can have your first pages up and running so that you will be able to sell. It takes three weeks and four weeks Four weeks right now. I'm going to say four weeks, and we can under 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 promise over deliver um, to get your system up and running. Anybody who signs up, when you sign up, you get billed 
but you don't get billed again until we deliver. So you don't have to worry about the months passing, et cetera. So just wanted to make that clear. Is that all good? Cool. All right. Uh, so that's Joe. Thank you. Thank you. Can you give the link for the demo? Yes. Uh, so Shay, it's just go to prospectfalcon.com. And so right. let, we've, we've had Nick with his hand up patiently there as well. So Nick, unmute bro and say hello. And oh, by Great the way, time. Patrick, nice to see you. Carter, Leo, Mika, Robert, like, thanks guys for jumping in with cameras and stuff. It's so good to see you. We've got 40 people on. My goodness. How did that happen? Barrington's here. Benji's here. Carter's here. David's here. Uh, somebody signed in with iPhone. That's cool. Jamie, Jared. Hey, Jared, I left you a message yesterday. Uh, Joe, John, the other John, Jonas, Kate, Keith, Ken, Leo, Marcio, Michael. Guys, you're amazing. Mika, Miles, uh, Milos, Patrick, Peter, Reggie, uh, Robert, Sam, Sarah, Trey. Oh man, I'm glad there's only 50 of us. Veronica, fantastic. All right, guys, nice to see you. Nick, go for it. All right, so if, uh, before I go forward, I'm going to go back to white, white label suite for a second because I'm still the novice at this, but I just got all the packages in my head off, ex expressed into the packages section. Okay. My, I'm not quite sure where it ties. I've got it, you know, Kyle, help me get it into our, I'll share my screen if that's okay. Oh, yeah, sure, mate. Go for it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, where is it? There we go. Okay. Come on, go to it. Okay, so... Wanted your opinion about my pricing a little bit, just just a high level, if you will, pun intended, in terms of my pricing. But I've ordered up with 100 leads a month, and then the you know the month, the bronze monthly, the bronze annual, the 250 leads a month or 3,000 a year, all the way up to the most expensive metal on the planet, rhodium. That was a joke, but anyway. Uh, but let's take the bottom levels here for a second. You know, I'm starting at a dollar a lead in the bottom plan. 90 cents a lead if you do it by the year. Then the next one is like 80 and 670 and then 60 and 50, if you can see the, the pattern here on the last yep. lines, okay? And stuff, just because you know all you, all the other clients, you know, you know, all the other partners with you and stuff, well, what are they you know, doing in terms of cost per lead? Just some WLS stuff. Okay, so cost per lead, um, in, in, so just in terms of package pricing, Nick, yes. like, yeah, cool. So- it depends on it depends on how you want to structure it. So um, you're you're going at yeah, a hundred bucks a month is a hundred leads. Um, sure. Yep, yeah. and then you're going three thousand for yeah, seventy cents a lead. That I mean, it makes sense. the The bigger packages they buy, the cheaper it gets. Um, it makes complete sense. I do you know what? The truth for me is always clear. Um, do you want to buy this rusty, crapped out bucket of bolts? with barely a windscreen in it for 5,000 bucks? No, thanks. Do you want to buy this incredible Ferrari with beautiful wheels and the top line turbo freshly polished off the showroom floor for 50,000 bucks? Hell yeah, absolutely. That's a bargain. Price doesn't matter. It's what they get that matters. So mm -hmm. if you're if you're selling the leads for a dollar, or ten dollars, or twenty cents, or you know, pick your price. It matters how the customer feels when they buy that. So, you know, you you think think about you need to be able to convey value to the business, right? So, if you're selling if you're selling leads for a dollar, um, it's it's easy for me to be able to make that calculation in my head: hundred leads, hundred bucks, sweet and happy, um, and I'm gonna go to you. Well, the cool thing is not many people compare because this kind of work for this kind of software is not really well known in the market at all, except in marketing agency space. Um, but you can say, okay, why, why am I getting a dollar leads from you when I can get, I don't know, 20 cent leads from that guy over there? Then it's about the value of what you're delivering. You can say, right. well, the data that this system delivers it's got, you know, fresh, up to date, never cached. It's live information. It's got the AI research. You've got the social data. You've got all of the enrichment information. You've got all that kind of stuff. So a dollar a lead, perfect. You know, that's the most expensive package. And then you get to um, sell people the bigger packages to get cheaper options. I think that's fine, Nick. That's all right. Cool. That makes perfect sense. I was, you know, the bigger companies that have higher tickets are obviously going to say, well, what a what a bargain that is for you know twelve thousand a year. You know what I mean? Uh, and so I, I, I was thinking of a percentage of the average ticket model because I've been in merchant services for twenty four years. It's like okay, scale of economy. So I was just wondering if this was a model that would be working. 
So my other big thing now is, uh, and what um, uh, Michael had brought up going into the, the LMS is since we have you know the, the top uh, the unlimited sub account agency type thing is is giving it giving them a GHL sub account I mean, and interfacing them right off the bat, pre CRM or LMS or what have you, right, Michael, great thing and stuff like that, and saying there's a trial period to this to this uh, LMS CRM whatever pre CRM and stuff mm. and having it all managed and therefore them you know and stuff. I just thought of it. So is that a good idea to say here, you get 30 days or 60 days with this, you know, whatever. Yes and no. Yes and no. Yes, because the system's freaking amazing. I mean, GHL is just, it's mm -hmm. a rocket ship at the moment. The starter button on the rocket ship's not working, but the rocket ship's rocking. It's great. It's amazing. So yes, it's freaking amazing. And no, because, oh my God, you get lost so quick in, in GHL. If you give somebody... So again, just personal experience, Nick. If you give somebody a, a, a free trial to GHL without any instruction, onboarding, um, use case development, handholding, you will never see them again. Because okay. I'm a I'm a self confessed absolute geek. It took me three months to learn my way around the system. And that was pretty like focused on what I was doing. Now I was learning the system and, you know, setting up workflows and doing all kinds of stuff. I wasn't just using it to get a phone number or whatever. Um, so if you give somebody a free trial and um, and you just give them a login, then no, not a good idea at all, at all. But if your systems are good and you give somebody a, like, again, just talking this out guys, like processing this verbally as I'm, as I'm thinking about, hey Benji, nice to see you, man. Um, if your process is automated, because you don't want to do this manually, but if your process is automated that goes, hey, welcome aboard, brand new leads tool. Let me show you something cool. Every time you get a lead, if you want to, and you're doing this on a video, right? If you want to, we've got an integrated CRM. Watch what happens. Lead into CRM, automatic message, follow-up system, opportunity board, one, two, three. Would you like to give it a try? Now I've got oh, this is not just a, a login to some dashboard. I can actually see what I'm doing. And then when they get in there, you've got a wizard onboarding system that goes, great, follow me, click here, right. create this, push that, do this, ta-da. Now your free trial, people are going to be like, just like, sweet, man, put my card on file and rebuild it up. So um, guys, how many, how many of you have ever downloaded a free course and you're like, wow, this is the best free course ever. Thank you so much for making this incredible material available. And it's in your hard drive somewhere with your best intention of coming in and getting it one day in the future. It's already out of date, by the way, but someday I'll get to it. One same course. thing happens with it. Yeah, once. Some th same thing happens with a free trial, right? Same thing happens with a free trial. Unless you take somebody by the hand and go click, do, look, ta-da. Then people right. go, wow. You gotta you gotta make sure that they use it. Otherwise, your free trials will burn out. Okay. Gotcha. Thank you, so guys. I'm, I'm, go ahead. Yeah, good. Go ahead, no, 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 go. I was just gonna. I've got about fifteen questions that have, people have messaged okay. me. Okay, real quick. <laughs> you've yet to learn now that I've got it integrated in the Megafluence to our GHL and stuff like where are the automation staff are they are they would be in funnels and stuff like that and the, now that I have it integrated for the like, and the there be the page. point. There be the point you you're, you're in and you got to get it automated and all that kind of stuff. And that's, you know, you're doing it and, mm -hmm. and people feel just as confused. So hey, Nick, um, have you gone to whitelabelsweet.com forward slash onboarding and gone through those videos? Son, are you talking to me? <laughs> this week, no, this week, no, I Nick, no, found a way oh, of rearranging okay, so my okay. calendar dedicating to this because starting with this and Eric, uh, Eric is, you know, Eric is, is, is now looking at the enterprise stuff so that we can work on other bigger coaching things or whatever. So, you know, so it's, uh, it's quasi between what's his end of market MarTech and my end being SalesCon, self consultant. Okay. So it's like, but, uh, you know, you said three weeks. So you're a geek, all right? And I'm a nerd. Okay. So it took me eight months to learn most of this. Right. Stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, and, and uh, um, I mean, yeah, all the automations are there. There's some incredible help files with GHL and that kind of stuff. But um, your your customers feel more overwhelmed than you do. So most important that you give right. them a guide to be able to do that. Yeah, we have um, the wizard system to onboard them and stuff, but they're all, you know, a middle plan without overwhelming them with the automations, you know, social media automation. But you know what we've loaded in our system. We have an incredible bunch of add-ons of stats that go, you know, yeah, around yeah. the world and back, right? So, all right. Well, thanks for the time. Appreciate it. Hey, anytime, man. Anytime. Yeah. Uh, Leo Miles, I see you. Uh, Milos has asked a question. He said, I have Prospect Falcon. Is there a guide for this method? So guys, this is this is the guide. So I was just, just wrote this. I said, show them the site, ask them to talk to the bot, the chat, request a call back, then wait while they talk to the bot. And then when they finish, just ask them, is it Visa or MasterCard? Literally, I have been doing... People have been coming into our world that don't know us. There's there's a couple of questions here of people who who are it's first time on the call because they've been watching YouTube videos. They've been referred by other people. We've been doing podcasts and uh, webinars, etc., with brand new uh, audiences. So some of the people who are coming in, they they don't they don't know us. They've only known us for a couple of weeks. And they don't know GHL. They don't know any of that stuff. Yep. And so for them, this this. For the people who've been here for four years, you guys have such a massive advantage. For the people who've been here for two weeks, they're messaging me going, I can't wait to sell this to absolutely everybody. So that is that one. Um, all right. The next one is I've got, sorry, I'm, I'm getting to you, Leo and Miles. Just give me a second. Uh, Robert Ewald says, test your offer. They'll truly tell you what the market will support. All right. Dave Black. Dave, uh, jump on because Jack Goodard, dude, we haven't had a chance to catch up. I know our, our schedules aren't lining up so jack would love to hear about dave's experience dave go for it tell tell jack about your experience with us so far well basically i've uh had the opportunity to you know work with kyle and and lex on my setup of the enterprise system um they are doing an awesome job uh, I, i'm really pleased with what they've come up with so far they've kept me informed they've let me know you know how where they're at in the, in the process um, I, I expect within a week I'm going to be up and running, and I can't wait to have the opportunity to sell this because I think it's just going to blow up and be incredible. Fantastic, beautiful. Thank you so much, Dave. Hey, hey, Jack, Thanks, do you Sam. do you have, do you want to ask any questions, and then I'll move to Leo. No, no, no. Let 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 Jack Jack jump on and ask questions, but Leo and Miles have been waiting patiently, so um, go, go for it. Leo. Jump in, Leo. Jump for go for it, mate. How are you doing, by the way? Nice to see you. Uh, nice to see you guys. First and foremost, I'm beyond impressed with everything you guys do. And Thank you. the support that you guys give is unreal. So for Thank any you, anyone who's new here, you guys are fantastic. Thank uh, you. So a couple of just uh, te technical questions. Uh, so today I got delivery of my enterprise first phase, uh, mm -hmm. which I'm very delighted with it. Congrats. So you guys were talking, thank you. You guys were talking about the, the uh, special pricing and I want to follow the all-service oriented agency as opposed to the monthly small fees, if you will. Mm -hmm. So how do I go about repricing the packages and re recreating the packages? Is that something that we do on our own or we speak to Kyle or his staff to make the changes? It is, it, so the, the answer that Kyle wants me to give is once we deliver it, you can do what you like. Our system is delivered in a specific way, right? But Leo, if you drop a note to us that says, hey guys, can you please change my base package to this and my upsell package to that? It's about 60 seconds work for us to do it. So long as you tell us what you need. If you go, okay. please change my base price to that, my upsell price to that, and my uh, uh, you know resell link to this or my you know upsell link to that, um, Easy, man. We can do that for you without even a blink. No troubles at all. Now, that's not the answer that Kyle will give you because Kyle is our systems oriented specialist and he's a freaking legend because of it. He keeps Johan and I on track. His answer will be when we deliver it, that's what we deliver. Um, but the reality is if you want to change it, it's your business. So just tell us we're here to help and support and um, we will make that happen. And sorry, Kyle. Um, <laughs> and, and this goes no, with it. We're not... Guys, we're not, we, by the way, the enterprise system, the reason we can keep it the price it is, is because of the system that we deliver. It's 
it's a package that we can, that we know we can support, right? And we have that information and up, uh, ability. So when you change the prices, Leo, there's a few uh, on flowing things that need to be updated. And I just thought of, which is why Kyle now hates me for what I just said. Um, we need to update your bots. We need to update your, your voice system. So we need to update your knowledge base. So if you change the prices, we've got a few things to update. So it's going to take us more than two minutes, Kyle, sorry, but yeah, we, we can do that for you, man. But you can also, you can also change yourself as well. And that's why I wanted to ask this question because I just got a delivery of it today. So before mm. it goes too further into the development of the bots and everything else, I wanted to be able to catch on. Yeah. And this goes to a secondary compounded question. Since we're going to have the different services, you know, with, which will be the different bots, and that also that would also imply upsells to the client. Mm -hmm. Would that be something that you advise that we show a pricing on a package? Or that'll be something that we're going to do an upsell afterwards. In other words, great question. Great question. Explain those costs on the original on the on the uh, uh, physical website, or yep. that'll be something after the fact. So that's a really great question. Um, and psychology comes into that, Leo. By the way, did you get a? We sent you a gift. Did you get that in the? Did you get that delivered to as yet? Not yet, but I haven't checked my mail. Are you talking about in, in the mail? No, a nice like gift hamper basket should be arriving to you sometime in the next. And that was that was to be a surprise. What are you doing? It is a surprise. It's a surprise that yeah. hasn't arrived yet. Amazon's told me it's been sent. Um, it should be there okay. with you, Leo. It's being sent to you. Um, okay. So the the question was, um, if we've got uh, the different bots, do we advertise that on the on the site? And guys, this is for everything that you sell, right? For not just you know, we're not just talking about GHL. We're talking about all kinds of things. There's some psychology. If I tell you that our let's give an example, our base package is ninety seven dollars a month, you go. Cool. I I've kind of anchored that as ninety seven dollars a month, and I've got it in in my mind that that's the price. And then I say to you, um, or our unlimited package is twenty five thousand dollars a month. Immediately, what happens is you go, "Wow, that base package is so cheap, right?" Mm -hmm. Psychology. So there's a few things there, Leo, and I'll, I'll give you a straight answer in just a second. Um, so the, the second thing is, and this is something that we've experienced internally, if you have something that people can buy, you'll be surprised that people buy it. They're like, yeah, man, I'll just, I'll just take your top package. It's, it's no worries. Oh, I'm good. But it also depends on trust, right? If you're going to a cold market, they don't know you. They have no idea who you are. Um, and so spending a hundred bucks with someone you don't know. Okay, cool. I can do that. Spending a thousand bucks with someone I don't know. Eh, I'm a little bit hesitant. You know what I mean? But if you've got trust, if you're bringing people through a funnel and you're, you know, you've been working with them for a long time, they've seen you on social, you've been in contact with them, you've jumped on zoom calls with them. And then you put a $10,000 price point in front of them. They go, okay, yeah, sure. You know, like I, you've earned it. So all of that to be said, and here's my straight answer. All of that to be said, my suggestion is Bring people through a funnel. If you've got your lead system, your, your phase one up and running, you're ready to take sales. That's the entry point for you to establish credibility and trust with your client. My suggestion would be that you bring them in, give them a great experience, and then 48 hours later, introduce them to the next things that you can do for them. And that would be a separate page of your additional services. So it's like, welcome on board. This is, you know, this is your system. They get in, they go through your onboarding system, which is set up for you as well with phase one. Mm -hmm. So they go through your onboarding. They get a couple of messages from you, welcoming them, some like some nice information that's coming through. Then if you choose, and I would suggest a good way to go, is now you want to introduce them to other things that they can do with you. You've already got more trust. You've delivered on the first promise and you can put it there. So I would suggest that on your front page, you might have a link to the other services we provide but I would put the actual price of those other services in front of them only after they've established trust with you with the first entry point. That would be my own opinion. There'll be marketers on the page that will tell you different things, but that would be my own thoughts, Leo. And on that note, and I want to keep this short because I know people waiting for all the questions is because hmm. I wanted to follow what you guys, I guess, sold me or sold everyone else is that I want to be able to create the, you know, the, uh, the, the, you know, the, the, the 10, $20,000 package for clients. Yep. And that, that's what I that's what I really that's what my mindset is from day one. Perfect. Not a small package, but, but to be able to bring a client that is going to do a you know a ten, twenty thousand dollar set of fee and a monthly or five or ten thousand dollar package and a, an increment to thereafter. 
So that's what, I'm, what my mentality is from day one with this whole entire package. So correct me yeah. if I'm right or wrong on that. Oh, 100% right. 100% right. And um, what? so what the other packages that you're doing, Leo, what What are the, are you doing the, you're looking to build out the four bot system with them, the, the additional AI, or what are the correct. other packages that you're looking at? You want to do the AI stuff? Cool. So correct. we're fine. Like, this is why we call it a self-selling system. The, the beautiful thing about the Fallbot program is literally 24 hours after they've bought the first thing from you, the AI system calls them and says, hey, how you doing? Checking in. How's everything going? Did you get your logins? Did you manage everything okay? Have you been through the onboarding? This is all AI doing this call. And then the way that we've got it set up in, a, in the system that we deliver for you is the AI says, by the way, have you heard about our AI system that nurtures and follows up every lead? And you're experiencing one of those calls right now, right? So the best way to sell the higher end package is let people experience it. As Johan said, we're sending people to Prospect Falcon, getting them to click on the callback. They click callback, pop in their number, and then their phone rings and they have a conversation with our AI sales assistant. And then they just go to Johan, do you take Amex? Right? It's just like, dude, sign me up. The best way to sell this system is get people to experience it. So if you've got them engaged with your AI system through your, your system, Leo, um, then introduce them to the opportunity that they have this to buy from you as well. It's a great way to sell the additional services is, is they are experiencing it right there with you. So um, setting this up to sell the $10,000 and $20,000 packages, get them in on the leads program, get them experiencing the AI and let them know that the AI can also work for them. If they are interested, jump on a call. Let's let's get a booking set in the, in the calendar. Okay, and last question. Thank you very much. Last question. Is the website that we have right now, are you guys planning to put something that talks about the, the bots themselves? Um, so no, but we've got that in the, the upsell. So we're at the moment, we're building out the four bot landing page and we mapped it all out the other day. Um, and we'll give you guys that as a snapshot. So we'll just install it for you so you can have it on your own site. Um, so we won't have it on this front site. You can, if you want to, but, um, so because it's your business, obviously, um, what we deliver at the moment doesn't mention it, but we'll give you a snapshot which will install a landing page and a follow-up system and all that kind of stuff that you can put your own pricing on uh, within the next oh, Dallas next week, I'm going to say 10 days to 14 days, somewhere there. So that you have that whole kind of selling system for that four bot program with you as well. Um, so no, we're not putting it on the front of the site. We want to keep that. This is a lead generation system and I then introduce the additional things after they've got that first experience. Thank you. Thanks for your time, man. You guys are great. Thanks for your support. Hey, we love guys. you, man. So good to have you with us. Thanks, Leo. So do I. Thank you. Great to see you, man. Uh, so we've got Miles. Do you want to, should we jump to Miles or should, did you have somebody else you wanted to jump in there with? Go, go, go Miles, go. I'm, I'm, hey, Mr. Pearson. I'm busy chatting away and answering questions as much as I can. Oh. All right, cool. <laughs> yeah, great. Hey guys, um, I, I'd come on camera, but I'm actually in bed at the moment. So I'm in the UK. So love it's that. Bed-based <laughs> bed -based entrepreneurs. Should be a, yeah, should be a Facebook right. group. Right. I love it. Yeah. Um, Couple of things. I, I, I'm I'm going to sign up either for the enterprise either later this evening or tomorrow morning. Anyway, what the one or the other, but it'll happen. Um, now, the more I look, I mean, I've gone through your uh, the the trainings you do, did on implementing the the sales bot and also the voice bot and everything. Um, and the more you look at this, it's more like an onion, isn't it? You just keep pe <laughs> peeling off layer after layer after layer. There's right. just so go up to it um now when i when i uh sign up for this i pay my the sign up fee as it were and mm -hmm. you you mentioned then what what is the cycle of the billing afterwards is that um 30 days after you sign up or is it yeah yeah, yeah 30 days after so um so uh, with our enterprise program at the moment and this is strictly limited we're not charging any setup fee so yeah. if we when we when we get to setup fee, it's pay the setup fee and then you start to rebuild once it's delivered to you. Yeah. But at the moment there's no setup fee. So your first month payment, which is the 997, pretty much gets you the build. So we're going to build yeah. everything, we're going to have everything done for you, and we'll have it delivered back to you before the, your next rebuild cycle happens. So it's it. yeah, it's 30 days. Um, uh, and we will have that built, we'll have it all ready to go. You'll be able to take sales within a week. So right. from the moment that you say I'm in. Your branded setup 
system with your account ready to take sales is ready within seven days. And that means that you can start sharing it on social media. You can start saying, Hey guys, yeah. brand new tool, you know, uh, come and get your lead system from me. Uh, I've just invested in a software company, by the way, that's my favorite line of all time. If you've done yeah, a million other that. things. Yeah. If you've done a million other things in your life, you can tell people, Hey, I just invested in a software company. I think I've got a leads program you should check out. And people are like, Oh, you're a software company invested. That's amazing. Um, and you have your own business. So, um, we deliver it back to you in a week, Miles. The next, mm -hmm. the second and third week, we're training and setting up the AI systems. And then by the end of week three, your entire system is done, in uh, built, tested, upsells are in place, landing pages are done, package pricing's ready, onboarding system set up and done. So your, your business is ready. And then your, your next bill, the next time your credit card gets charged is 30 days after you're initially signing up. So yeah, um, yeah, good, good. Great. That's that's what you just said is rather useful. Thank you for that Your summary. Um, now, the other thing is I'm in the UK and obviously I'm going to chase UK businesses, but I also mm -hmm. want to chase uh, businesses stateside. Great. Can the system as currently delivered handle both currencies in yes. the sense that, I mean, I know the bot will, the speech side of the bot will adapt to any language anyway, because I mean, I, you covered that in the training. You've frozen on me. Oh, there you are. You're right. Your video's frozen. So, so that the language side of it, because I quite like, for example, either to well speak to the UK in a British voice, but then speak yeah. to the States in an American voice, or oh, maybe a British voice, because I know it tends to go down well over there. Um, but um, yeah, so can it handle but, but those two scenarios? Yeah, definitely. So when we set up the pricing for you, um, we'll typically deliver it in, in US dollars, but it's so easy to set up a, a, a pounds variant or a euro variant or a US dollars variant. Um, and then your, so the, the only tricky part, Miles, comes from, um, I'll, I'll get geek here just for a second. Yeah, it's okay. I'm, I'm a geek as well. It comes right. from geo, geo redirecting, right? So yeah. geo, geo <laughs> redirecting is something where if I come to your site from America, I see this page. But if I come to your site from the UK, I see that page. Yeah, and, yeah. and geo redirecting doesn't happen natively inside of GHL, but we've set it up um, for a couple of our clients. There's a system that costs about 10 bucks a month and I'm just going to Google for it and I'll find it. Um, and that will allow you to, um, to have those different price pages showed. There it is. First, first, um, first option. It's called geotargetly.com. We set this up for a couple of clients. We charge them, I think 25 bucks a month for it, but it's 10 bucks a month. Um, and you can set it up on your own site. So let me just drop this in the chat wherever I can find my chat. So I presume uh, it's, it, it produces of your landing page. It produces like an overlay, as it were. No, no, it redirects. No? It redirects. No, it does redirect. So it's, it's, it's a separate page. Yeah. So, so the way it works is it literally picks up the IP of the incoming query and redirects to yeah. whatever you've set it. So in Australia, we have, yeah. um, we have a, a different tax rate GST, but if you're buying product from overseas, you don't pay that GST. So our clients wanted to charge GST to Australians, but not GST to others. So that's what we yeah. use that for. Um, and as I said, it's about 10 bucks, but you set it up, you, you literally just install a piece of code on your, on your website. So you set up, the American page and the UK page, and then you yeah. set up GeoTargetly to redirect that traffic excellent, based on excellent. where they're coming That's from. That's just what I was after. Brilliant. Cool. For that. That's really good. Okay. Well, I look forward to working more. I mean, I've got a white label suite, and I apparently my does my white label investment uh, pro rata off against the uh, enterprise. Yeah, yeah. Great question. So, uh, are you on the are you on the monthly plan, Miles, or are you on the annual? No, plan? annual. You're annual. on the annual plan. Amazing. Yeah. Um, so um, hit up our team after the call and we'll we'll make sure we, we get all that lined up for you. Look at that. If, you, if, you, if, you, if you, you reach out to Kyle, he'll get you set up. Yeah. Thanks, man. Okay. Thanks for that. And one other last thing, which is slightly off topic in a way. I mean, I, I'm a big fan of uh, John Logar's training for obvious reasons. <laughs> Who isn't? Um, excellent stuff. Um, now, unfortunately... He, I mean, he gave a he did a two week uh, training series recently um, in the last month, um, but unfortunately, I was in hospital having surgery at the time, so I couldn't actually. That's no excuse, me. Miles. Come on, sir. I know, I know. <laughs> I, I, I spoke to the surgeon, but it was not having any of it. Hey, so just sell him a leave package, mate. He'll be fine. <laughs> um, do you no. know? Is there any way I can get 
get hold of the re recordings of it. Yeah, definitely. Uh, let me just ping John right now and I will get that link for you. Uh, actually, Kyle, do we have that link um, somewhere in our Rolodex of, of links? Um, if not, I'll just grab that from uh, from John. We'll, we'll, we'll get it from John. We, we don't have it there. Um, Thank cool. you for that. Thank you, Miles. Hey, looking forward to having you on board. Yeah, yeah. man. Yeah, well, looking forward to it myself. I'm hey, um, John, John just posted his uh, version of the Leeds program in the thing. Man, that looks amazing. Sorry, didn't mean to cut you off there, Miles, but wow, that looks incredible, John. So good. Um, yeah, Miles, can't wait to have you on board, man. It's going to be amazing. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, well, well, we'll we'll speak to you guys later. Awesome, mate. Thanks again. Hey, thanks for again. jumping on, and thanks for staying up late, too. Oh, all right. it's all right. <laughs> I've, got, I've got tons of messages about merch. So Mika wants merch. Uh, Dave wants merch. Everybody, guys, uh, just letting you know, Robert has done all of our merch. So if anybody needs merch, I'm going to point to Rob because, hey, we all support each other. So right. have, have a conversation with Rob. And Rob, if you can just come on and introduce yourself uh, so everybody knows who you are. That way, guys, reach out to Rob. He can hook you up with all the merch that you need. He's done ours, and it's just been, it's been epic. Quick turnarounds. Mm. So there you go. All right, cool. Uh, oh, sorry. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. So, um, um, I, uh, if everybody wants their own merch, Robert Earworld, amazing. The man is on fire. He's going to get it for you. That's exactly what uh, Johan just said. Robert Earworld, get your merch from Robert. If you're looking for white label sweet merch, we actually made a conscious decision this year not to do tumblers and hats and t-shirts and stuff like that. Um, but if you're coming to Dallas, I am bringing. Let me do my conversion in pounds. 26 pounds of chocolate Australian confectionery to give away in Dallas, right? My wife's gone crazy. Why am I packing my half of my suitcase with Australian chocolate? Because we want to give away to you guys. Um, we've just had, we've had shipped hundreds of koalas and stuff like that. Not uh, real uh, ones. Kyle's <laughs> entire, entire suitcase is filled with close to 300 koalas and kangaroos and stuff like that. So guys, come come to, come to us for Australian merch. White label sweet merch. Australian merch. It won't be white label sweet merch. It's just Australian merch. We, 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 hey, hey guys, can I hop in for a second? <laughs> yeah, go, it, mate. We want it to be for your company. So that's why it's your merch, white label sweet, and it's all good. Go, Rob. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for the opportunity to, to help you guys with all this. Um, what we can do for the U.S. based people, if you want white label, sweet branded merch, uh, we can throw together, we can, we can spool up an online merch store for them, uh, where we can handle all the fulfillment production, all of that stuff and, and have that available. So if anybody wants, wants that, we could probably have that spooled up in, in running by the end of tomorrow. Um, and there'll be a revenue share back with, uh, WLS for, uh, for that as well. So everybody wins. Nice. Thanks, man. That's cool. Good to know. Amazing. We, we might, um, we might see what we can do there. Leo, did you want to jump in? Uh, I can see that raised hand, my friend. No, already there. All right. I'll, I'll flick over to David. David. Hey mate. Good to see you. Thanks for jumping on. Hi. Good, good evening. Yeah. I'm, I'm here in the UK and I've just bought the enterprise plan. Hey. Can you hear me? Yes, yeah, we, we got you, man. We got you. Good. Yeah. And literally, I just had my onboarding with Lex, Lex Luthor. Well, Fantastic. Lex Chambers. Lex yeah. Chambers, Lex Luthor. So great, great. I'm excited to be in it and looking forward to building out the whole thing and, and great going day, out there to market it. Yeah. I just I just know one thing. I just noticed that. I just realized that, obviously, the sub account is going to be within, within the white label suite sub account. Yeah, because I already had my GHL agency account running, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, and I was looking forward to like managing the clients inside of my GHL account. Uh, I think yep. I'm just keeping Kyle about it. This is this is a this is an easy one to answer, and I'm so glad you brought it up. So, what we deliver back to you, the reason we do it in our sub account, David, is because we provide that end to end support. So when yeah. you have a person, like you have a customer, uh, somebody buys from you, they ask a question, our team's going to handle that for you, but. You also like, yeah, but I, I've already got my GHL. Like, why? I don't want to log into two different places and all that stuff. So super easy to, to set up. All we do is when they become a customer, so not, not a prospect, not a, not a marketing lead, all that kind of stuff, you'll have that database anyway. You can, you'll have admin access to that database, right? So you can always just right. jump in. You've got full control over it, right? But when they become a customer, all we'll do is set up an automation that pushes them across on a webhook to your existing GHL account. 
well, when they become an enterprise customer, you mean? Or well, whenever you tell us, if like if they buy the lead system from you and you're there like yeah. now a paying customer and you're like, I want that person in my database because I want to be able to, you know, look out whatever well, whatever I want to be able to do. Yeah, if you sorry. just if you just set up a um an automation and again we'll give you the system to do it we'll push that that buyer across to you so that you'll have all your buyers in your database and all your marketing leads are will be in the other one right because I, mean, I remember you were talking about and you were talking about selling them like getting them in first because yeah. my strategy is to get them in like with like a like base GH, ghl account yep. maybe like a night seven box account and they come Perfect. in and then we can then obviously the AI bot is now going to upsell the four bot system to them because uh, I'm wondering that when I sell them that first package, is it going to sit under your GHL account or is it going to sit under my GHL account? On or yours. Is... On yours. Okay. On yours. So, um, right. Yeah, so so when we deliver back the enterprise program to you guys, you have a lead generation software business open and ready to take money. You have right. an AI set up, you have all the follow-up happening, you have all of the, the beautiful magic that we've seen over the last four or five weeks open for business, right? Which is great. Then as that as you are getting traffic coming into that system over here on the left-hand side, traffic, people coming in, being nurtured, being qualified, buying stuff from you, whatever happens after that point, is completely on your system. So it's like, right. we, we deliver you back this working system over here. And then from there, they're, they're, everything else happens on your system. So you might sell them video marketing, sell them GHL, sell them SEO, sell them whatever else you want to sell them. Sell them the four bot system. Great, amazing. But all of the extra stuff, everything after that initial sale, we're going to be mm -hmm. directing them back to your account. So right. the AI, the AI will be doing the upsell for you, but it might say something like, hey, um, can we also do some video marketing and some social media for you? Yeah, great. Let me send you a website. And that website's going to be on your GHL. So whatever you want to sell them after that first sale is all in your system. Okay, so it's only when I now have enterprise customers, I can then push them to you to mm -hmm. build out for them. Yep. And they will then sit under your account because you can support them. And because um, that was so, what Lex was saying. I, I, yeah, right. I, it's it, it gets a little bit confusing. So let me let me yeah. see if I can let me see if I can qualify. So um, uh, Robert's still on the call with us. Robert Robert has a um uh, a, an amazing methodology. What he wants to do is he wants to sell the four bot system, right? Mm -hmm. And he wants to charge whatever he wants to charge. I think Robert, you were talking to a bank the other day with a twenty thousand dollars setup and ten thousand a month or something like that. Now he wants that customer right? To pay him 20 grand and then 10 grand a month. And he's just right. going to pass the customer to us to fulfill it for him. Exactly. Now, yeah. in, in that circumstance, our point of contact is Robert. We will never, 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 never speak to the bank because the last thing that Robert wants to happen is for the bank to Google who's white label suite. Oh, I could have got this for 5,000. Oh, you know, so if you want us to be the fulfillment house, we are mm -hmm. white label, but that means that we are we're your black box supplier. We don't exist. You're just passing it to us and say, hey guys, build it for me, all right? And then yeah. we deliver it back to you, you deliver it back to the client and go, ta-da, right? Now, the, the alternative to that is that you just send it to us and we pay you 30%. So it's like, hey, you want us to build your own thing? Cool, go and speak to the guys at White Label Suite and uh, they'll hook you up. Right. So you, you might, but that means you have to keep the pricing at whatever we charge you because they're going to Google it. They're going to see it. They're going to know it's there. So if you want us to be your white label fulfillment house, then you are our customer. Your right. customer doesn't even know we exist. So if they have a question, they're going to come to you. Right. And you're going to come to us and we're going to give you the thing and we're going to support it. But they don't know we exist. We are your white label fulfillment house, right? So that means you can Perfect. charge them whatever you want. They won't even know that we, we're here in the background. But if you send them to us and you say, hey, guys, here's a new lead. Go and, uh, you know, do your thing. Then they'll be communicating with us. They'll have our team doing all of the thing. They'll, they'll get to know us. They'll be seeing our prices and we'll just send you 30%. Um, so yeah. whichever way you want to play it, completely up to you. But if you if you want to be the... The, the, the reseller and charge your own price, that means we need to only communicate with you so that we keep that um, veil across your provider, yeah? Does that make sense, David? 
Absolutely, absolutely. So so that account is now going to sit in, for example, Rob, so the bank's GHL account is going to sit under Rob's agency. Exactly. So yes. you're going to go into Rob's agency and build out that account for. So exactly. To, I think I think you need to educate, probably, I don't know, not educate. You're right, man. Tell <laughs> Lex. You're because absolutely it was, right. It was, it, was, it was a big topic this morning, I literally 10 minutes before your call. I think Carl has to come in. Cal, Cal dialed into the call as well, the, the onboarding call. And I was a bit, I was a bit confused. I, I was like, look, you know, so what we then decided was that I'm, I was going to keep like the two separate accounts, which yeah. is not definitely what I was. So thank you very much. Walt, for Man, we, 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 I, we got you. Look, guys, this yeah. is, this is five, six weeks old. And up until three weeks into this process, <laughs> we didn't even conceive of the fact of you guys reselling the four bot system. It wasn't until somebody said to us, oh my God, every business on the planet, I want to sell this. We went, huh, how can we help people do that? Well, well, we'll fulfill it for them. All right, cool. Let's make that happen. So we are building that support infrastructure behind the scenes. But what we like for everybody on the call, how many people we got? 44 people on the call. For everybody here on the call, if you've known us for a minute or a year or a lifetime, this is what you need to know about us. Everything we do, we do for you to protect you, your business, and make you look good. We will never, ever, ever jeopardize you in front of a client. We will never, ever undercut you. We will never, ever make you look bad in any way. We are here to grow and support your business. And what that means is sometimes we're going to stumble. We're going to go, hang on, wait a second. Robert, I need to get this answer from the bank because they are having a trouble. And Robert's like, Oh yeah, just give me a minute, right? Like, so it, we we just want to protect you and your business, and we're kind of making that piece of it up as we go along, as we're building the infrastructure to support David. But what that means is, you make go out there and make some money, and we'll do everything in our power to make sure that that is a smooth smooth operation for you. Can I can I back you guys Thank up you on that for a quick second? Absolutely. So, in in my world, in all the stuff that we do, we white label things all the time right so your name is perfect for for this however uh just to kind of give some some depth to this the way you guys are handling these these larger projects is amazing because that the fear that so many people have as a marketer or as a um as a person selling this stuff is somebody's going to do exactly what you said, Google it and, and, and become, uh, get, find it, find a different price. Um, right. And the way you guys are handling that and your, your integrity and your, um, you're protecting your, your clients, the way you guys do that is amazing. And I can say that Thanks, from man. working with you guys, both as a, as a customer and as a vendor, your integrity and the, the way you guys handle stuff, I wish all of our clients operated the way that you guys do. Thank you, man. That's very good of you. That's awesome. I appreciate that. Um, yeah. So, man. I, again, thank you so much. We we really we really value that. That's that's our um, that's our commitment. You know, we we are here for you guys. That's that's what we're all about. So, yeah, man, absolutely. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Um, so, yeah, guys. Like, and again, um, if you if you come to us and say, hey, guys, can you do this for me? But make it like great example for all other enterprise customers. Any, we provide support for your customers. Did you know that? But we provide that support in your brand. So if they come to us from um, Black Panther Leads or they come to us from Opti Leads or they come to us from wherever, our team are going to be answering in your brand, in your in your name. So all of the supports, that's the other reason that we, we do the enterprise plan is when you make a sale of the Leads program, we are actually, we're doing the support of your first 100 customers on that, right? What, what happens after 100 customers? After 100 customers, you're doing 10 grand a month, and we're going to charge you probably another 500 bucks to do your next 100 customers because we'll bring on a dedicated staff member to handle your overflow. But your first 100 customers are included. So that's again, that's completely on on our um, our drive here is to make sure that you are the business that has the growth opportunity, and we're just your support mechanism in the back. Yeah, that's what we're here for. And another thing, guys, we are building this so that we're building this for you so that you can sell your company. So you can build right. a car so that you can sell the company and, you know, cash out. Just point to your relationship and go, here's my fulfillment house. You, you get, here's you get my out. revenue stream. <laughs> What's my valuation? 
never build a business without an exit plan. So we want to make sure that you have that exit plan. And then, you know, in, in SaaS world, you're getting between four to 10 X multiples and companies getting bought up all the time. If you guys want to have some fun, go and sign up to acquire, uh, what is it? Acquire.com. And yeah, I understand. Every, every day I just go, I go shopping on acquire.com. Hey, just, 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 just understand how awesome it is and build your, your mindset so that you know that what you're building, you're, you're going to be selling this in whenever, whenever you want, if you want that, I'm just saying it's a, it's a good strategy to have. Um, Mika, you had a couple of questions. Do you want to just jump on and ask us? And happy to. Hi, Mika. So nice to see you. Hey, we're going to see Mika in. Yay! And so when she comes, Mika, I got something special for you. Can't wait yes, to get... I most definitely will be in Dallas. Which question? I don't know. I've been over here just typing my little fingers off. Um, I keep up. So I just said, let's just jump up. <laughs> which which question? No, whichever. Fire one. off. Any any that you like. The only thing I always guys. I look after you, right? The only questions I don't answer is cooking questions. I suck. I can't cook. But anything else is open game. <laughs> um. So, I mean, for myself, you might have addressed some of them, but I do. I guess I'm just trying to get clarity. Um. So, does the bot do the upsell? I, I know the bot is ideally doing the upsell for you. Is it sending messaging on pricing? So, do we have to decide if I'm going to charge, let's say, double what you guys are charging? Right? Is the bot <laughs> having those conversations? with the or sending like emails um is there is there any pricing contained in those conversations or is it setting up an appointment for us to have those conversations it's setting up an appointment so the the upsell bot as we deliver back in the package mika is um doing that upsell getting that initial interest and then sending them to you to to close the deal because so you can do it on a case by case basis you don't necessarily 100% hundred percent. Exactly. We, we want a qualified buyer in your calendar after having a conversation, having an initial conversation with the upsell bot. And then you're on the call going, Hey, so you spoke to my AI assistant. Now let's, you know, carry this forward and, and make that happen. So, um, yeah, it, it, otherwise it gets too messy because if the bot's making pricing promises and you're like, Oh no, if it's a, if it's a big deal, you want to custom tailor that that conversation with that client, right? So the, the upsell bot will simply get them interested and book them in with you. Okay. And then at that point, you can decide what you want to charge. I, that was kind of my question because I didn't know what pricing was in there. If, if the, if the pricing was determined in the, in the template or whatever. No. So that one, it's just a interest qualification booking. Okay. So that was the last question that I asked. I don't you look stressed. You look stressed. How can I take that off? I don't. You? I'm just tired. I'm just getting over a migraine. Can we can can we ship can we ship uh, Mika a pillow? Somebody like, <laughs> so you, get, you know branded. We look after you. Hey, so you better be strong. Yeah, there you go. Nick's giving you a big hug. You better be strong oh. in Dallas because I'm going to give you a hug when I see you. So I'm just like fair warn. I will. That goes for all of you guys, by the way. I've never been hugged so much as Dallas last year. So I'm like I'm coming with the hugs. I'm bringing them. For sure. Are we going to be doing any sort of like uh, attempt at a meetup for people who are at the event? Yes. We, I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll organize everyone. I'll get you all in a... I'm so glad That's you took that, mate, because I, I just have no capacity to do that. But Johan's the best organizer of all. So that's awesome. Thank you, man. No okay. problem. I will do that. Um, cool. Mika, take magnesium for the migraine. Be I awesome. take magnesium daily. Tons of it. Nice. Thanks. Leo, Leo's got a question and then I'll have one more question and then guys we got to close up because we got to go pack our bags to get ready to head head over there and we've got a big big uh, you know webinar tomorrow talking about yep. what how we're going to be selling it so that you guys can literally copy we're going to give you all of our material so that you can hit the ground running so quick question just to follow up on David David's uh, scenario uh, in regards to the servicing because uh, you guys were talking about something about what, when we bring a client to you guys uh, to fu to fulfill, we're talking about something about servicing our clients afterwards, after it's been created. Uh, how does that work? Great question, Leo. So, um, so we're servicing the customer of the leads program. So your program set up, somebody comes to the site, buys that lead system from you and has a question. What we've set up uh, and what we deliver back is that that question will come to our team. So we set up your own, uh, I can't remember what your your brand is, but we set up help.yourbrand.com and we set up uh, a, a, an email connected to the system as well. So when your customers are in, they're, they're in their leads program, they're doing their searches, they're, you know, having, and they go, oh, how does this work? When they send that question 
it's going to come to our support team and our support team will answer that for them. So it's going to be 85, 90% AI support because all of the answers have already been asked and in there, but any overflow questions, we, we handle that too. So anything that can't be answered by the AI will come to our human support team and they will deliver the answer back to your customer for you in your brand. Fair enough. Thank you. You're welcome. No worries at all. Sarah had a question as well. I think we have time for Sarah's question and then we'll Go for it, because I've, I've got five more questions that I gotta answer. So Okay. All right, okay. go for it. I, I lowered my hand when I heard that your guys are about to check out, so I don't want to hold you guys up. No, no, um, we're here for you. Go go for it. Awesome. I know some of the question has been answered. So let's say I go with the enterprise plan and you guys set up everything, you deliver it. I go out and sell enterprise. Yep. Um and, and let's say I'm I'm going to go ahead and build it out and deliver it to them. Do I need to sign up for the whole separate, um, like, synth mode? They will be in my agency in GHL, right? But the synth flow account that we get with you guys, is it just for one sub account? Or are we able to use it to service our clients? Yeah, great question. Great question, Sarah. So um, what, what we deliver back to you is a complete package that sells one thing. And that one thing is your lead generation software. And then as we just said, uh, Tamika before, it will also upsell with, are you interested to anything else that you tell us that you want that upsell to point towards, right? So the system we deliver you includes Closebot, includes Synthflow, includes a GHL account, includes our lead gen software. That is your boxed up software company ready to take sales of that lead gen program. But if you want to sell your own sub accounts of Closebot, or you want to sell your own sub accounts of Synthflow, you will need your own white label account with those platforms. Wait, so what we give okay. you is an, yeah. So what we give you is an AI system that works self-selling, does the sales and it sells your lead gen program. But if you then want to uh, additionally sell the other AI systems and handle the uh, the setup and deployment yourself, you'll need those accounts with those separate companies as well. So we give you it to sell your system. And then if you want to also sell it, you'll need your own account out there as well. Makes sense. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're mm -hmm. welcome. Great to see you. Johan. By the way, I have uh, two announcements that even you don't know about, Mr. Walt. I know, surprise. Hey, Sarah, guess what? Are you there? Sarah, come back. Come yes, back. I'm here. Yes, I'm here. Come, come on video for a second. <laughs> I'm here. Can you hear me? Can you come on video or not? Oh, I'm driving. I can come on video, but I'm no, driving. No, 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 what stay, no, no, no. Stay safe. Oh, hi. <laughs> okay. Turn your video off. Eyes on the road, Sarah. Eyes on the road. Guess what? Yep. We got your ticket what? to the conference. You're coming with us. What? Yep. Did it summer? Yep. You're lying. I'm not lying. I'm serious. No, uh, I was I was gonna say I'll just come and meet them, you know, you know, stay with the meetup. No, okay, I mean, just want to let you hook know, us, hook up with you oh afterwards. We'll make sure we get there. Yeah, yep, you. Uh, <laughs> anyway, Reggie's coming too, so look, I'm so getting ready. Oh to my gosh, well. I'm excited! I'm <laughs> excited. Thank you so much. You guys are the best. Well, now you, so you guys better book some flights. Huh? Contact get uh, Johan will get in touch with you after the call, but you know. Conference oh. starts next week. Books and flights. Pack a bag. See you soon. Awesome. Well, I live in Dallas. Oh, if well, then don't pack, don't to... book a flight because then you'll be in the wrong I place. I don't need to book a flight. <laughs> but if you guys want me to help you out picking a spot for the meetup, let me know. You're but, amazing. Yes, that would be amazing. Thank you. Cool, there. You're welcome. Well, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> to see you. What a surprise. See you. Awesome. All right, guys, if we don't have any other questions, we are going to close up. I'm going to ask one more question. Does anybody have one more question? Otherwise, I'll see you in uh, how many hours? Well, like, oh, you're... dude, uh, I don't know. I can't even count time zones, but like 48 hours. We'll be there. No, no, no. I'm talking about our webinar tomorrow. Oh, webinar tomorrow morning. Oh, God. Don't ask me to do time time zones. Uh, 21 hours from now. Um, we're going to be online. And tomorrow is we are just going to be unveiling what we're talking about in Dallas. And again, our whole thing in Dallas is use this system to sell more GHL, to build your SaaS business, to build your recurring income. How? How? We're going to tell you that tomorrow on the call, right? We're going to show you how this system can help you build your SaaS business, all right? Tomorrow oh. at 3 p.m. Eastern, 
Okay, 3 p.m. Eastern, we're going to jump on. We're going to show you all our collateral for Dallas. We're going to basically be doing, this is what we're talking about in Dallas, so that when you come to Dallas, you can just focus on coming and getting some Australian candy from us when we're, we're in the store, because you'll already know what we're doing. All right. Thank you, guys. You guys are legends. I, thank you so much for everybody jumping on. Um, so thank cool to hang guys. out with you. Amazing to see you guys here. And we will see you 3 p.m. Eastern if you want to find out what we're doing in Dallas. If you want to find out how to use this system to grow your SaaS business, come along tomorrow. That's what we're here for. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. Thank you so much. Cheers. Bye, Mika.